Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. My name is Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal fullback Lee Dixon. And what we have for you is live coverage of the Super League coming right up. It is St. Gallen, and they take on FC Zurich. Yeah, Derek, cracking atmosphere as usual here. That will lead to a nervy, energetic start. Frenetic, fast play to begin with before it all settles down. I'm really looking forward to this one. Tremendous block. And taken short. Well, the ball brought down under no real pressure. Cisse. He's in with a chance. The net is staring him in the face. And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Moving forward effectively. Kololi. Dumbia. Cisse. Well, keeping hold of the ball is what it's all about for them. And intercepts again. Jordi Quintilla setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. A fine block. I must say he's let himself down with really flabby finishing there. Yeah, he wasted opportunity from the short distance. You see the manager's frustration on the touchline. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Dumbia, Kololi, Cisse, Rietziu. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Jordi Quintilla. Quintilla. Over the touchline for a throw-in. Marquesano. Cisse. A bit sloppy in possession. Space for the cross. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Quintilla. Dangerous looking attack. Not the best challenge, free kick. 
He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. Dangerous ball, a deft clearance. Well, possibilities in the centre. Plays it back. And simple for the keeper. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Ball's gone. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lucky. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Marquesano. Couldn't hang on to it. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Now, potential danger. And the keeper did more than enough. They are a goal down, but perhaps a chance to create something from this corner. And now the delivery. And did his job defensively. Another corner conceded. What can they do with this one? Played into the centre of the box. And they deal with the threat this time. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. As you can see, the visitors haven't had too much of the ball, but they won't mind. They're winning this game. And why? Because their counter-attack is absolutely fantastic. Can they get in behind them? Good tackle, take it away. Half an hour remaining then. They've lost it. Moving it forward. Really getting stuck in. Walner. Marquesano. Dumbia. Cisse. And a good tackle. A chance to whip it in. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging for someone to get on the end of it. And what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the goalkeeper absolutely no chance. Fantastic goal.
so 2-0 now. Keeping the ball moving. And he's taken it away. Dumbia. Antonio Marcassano. Hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. Walner. Marcassano. Oh, good vision. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Marquesano. Dumbia. Intelligent threaded pass here. Poor pass under no real pressure. Quintilla. And only two minutes remaining here. And a useful cross. Well, no problems defensively. Walner. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans were hoping for before a ball was kicked today. Defeat for them. A real lack of concentration for me has cost them today. Mistakes too. Manager will be looking around for that drawing board to start all this again. They were poor today, Derek. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance this evening, Lee. Well, that was a really, really good performance from the lad and a goal to boot. Really delighted with that goal, I'm sure he is.